My name is Jenna Bosiger, and thank you for watching my Cryptic Cryptids YouTube channel. Get ready to be amazed, because today we're going on a virtual journey to discover ancient geoglyphs revealed by Google Earth. Geoglyphs have been discovered all around the world. These incredible designs are massive, intricate works of art etched into the Earth's surface, and they are made by ancient race of prehistoric people or hominids in Southern California. And using Google Maps, you can zoom in to the desert surface and still find things, still find geoglyphs that either haven't been discovered or are basically unknown. If you are looking at the surface where these geoglyphs are with Google Sky Maps, you won't be able to actually see them until you zoom in and zoom in and zoom in to the ground. After I did my video about Topak Maze, I found this map and it said that there were anthropomorphic geoglyphs that had been destroyed, but that there were some still up in this area that hadn't been destroyed yet. And I began looking for these anthropomorphic creatures that were prehistoric and connected to the Topak maze. Eventually, I did find a geoglyph. I found this circular giant geoglyph. So here's Topak maze. And the hearts represent things that I've sort of discovered, but the big discovery, the most important discovery is really close to the road actually right next to the maze there it is you can see the seed coming out of the circle it must be ancient and connected with the Topak maze, but I've never heard anybody mention it. You don't have a lot of detail to see the design, but I started looking to see if there were any sacred geometric shapes that looked similar to this one. And the one that it came closest to was the seed of life. This is a more simplistic design of it. But what is really interesting is in the lower left-hand corner, you can see that one of the seed shapes is coming out of the circle, which I've never seen before. But to me, that symbolizes that this is where human life was first seeded. We don't know how old the culture was that made the Topak maze or any of the intaglios, but in San Diego at the Cerruti Museum, scientists have just proven that there were hominids living in Southern California 130,000 years ago. So there's no telling how old these are, but all over the desert in Southern California, in the Colorado desert between Arizona, California, and Nevada, I've been finding all kinds of geoglyphs since I started this, and there's gonna be a series. And the other thing to look forward to is that I met up with esteemed Bigfoot researcher, Jaime from Sierra Sasquatch, who's also been featured on Monster Quest on the History Channel. And he's been tracking Bigfoot in the Sierra Nevada mountains for years now. And I met up with him at the Intaglios to look at the giant that I hadn't even seen yet. And we did it using drone technology. If you're interested in that, make sure you subscribe and hit the notifications because that video will be coming up shortly. I am in the process of moving right now, so it's a little hectic, but thank you so much for watching. Hit the subscribe, hit the like. I really do appreciate it. And until next time, bye. Are things on the ground that have not yet been discovered that you can find by using Google Maps. You just have to remember to zoom in.